Okay, what's going on here is I've got WSPR being monitored on uh, four different instances of Kiwi SDR. This one is the low frequency at 135 kilohertz, and I pulled in a couple stations there so far. Same station two times. And over here we're at the medium frequency, uh, 474.95. And as you can see, I pulled in several stations over a period of time. And on this tab, I've got uh, 160 meters at 183735. And you can see I pulled in a few stations there that have, that have been recorded. And here we're at uh, uh, 30 meters at uh, 10139.45 kilohertz. And once again, we have pulled in a few stations and we're in the process of getting some more. And up here we have the WSR spots. I'll refresh this screen. All of these that ended 26, uh, 2016, 11, 26, have been pulled in tonight. When you get to 25, that was yesterday's experiments. But you can see that we've got all these different bands being recorded and the spots being uploaded to sprnet.org where you upload your spots. Now this is all just receive. I'm not uh, transmitting anything. I'm simply receiving this. But this is all being done on the Kiwi SWR, SDR, uh, on one computer. I have the audio muted on each screen so I don't have to listen to the WSPR whistle. So this is the best WSPR receiver I've ever seen. Probably about all my computer can handle given the bandwidth and so forth that all this takes up. But I am doing it here locally. I'm not actually going over the internet because the receiver is on my own network. Well that's probably enough video to explain what's going on here. So this is KA7U and we'll stop the video.